Hi everyone, it is time for my Sensi Whip Box. I am always so excited to share this with everyone and I hope that you stick around and join me. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to see you guys. So I want to just give a quick shout out. Thank you everyone for all your support. My subscribers, you guys are awesome and I am so blessed to have you in my life. It, I just get so excited to see you every now and then. So thank you for stopping in to visit. If you are new to my channel, I hope you click on that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos. And today is Tuesday and I think it's Fat Tuesday. So the uh, Mardi Gras colors, woohoo. Yeah, we used to have a friend back home in Pawtucket that loved to cook Cajun food and every year they had a big Mardi Gras party. So yeah. So anyway, today I've got my Scentsy Whip box. I'm so excited about this. So I get my Scentsy Whip box as part of my Scentsy Club. So I get mine every month regardless. But you do not have to get it like that. I mean, if you wanted to, you could get it every month. You can sign up to get it every two, every three months. Or you can just get it as a one-time thing. It changes every month. So on the first of the month to the last day of the month, you're going to get different items. So just very, very cool. It's $30. Um, there are shipping costs that are involved with it. You're going to get at least get um, $30 worth of full-size products in here. Sometimes you get a couple of samples and it's just it's just really fun because I love all things Scentsy and they have so many different things. If you go onto their website, oh my gosh, they have so many different warmers. So pretty. There is something for everybody's taste. As And as far as the uh, wax bars, the cubes, they have oils, they have diffusers, they have um, like buddies for children like stuffed animals, stuffed toys like that, and uh, fabric and laundry detergent and bath, bath products and kitchen and cleaning products, all kinds of things, all beautiful scents, all great healthy, healthy materials, so just really, really fun. So, Scentsy, you get a little kind of a like a hodgepodge. You never know what you're going to get, but it's Scentsy, and I know that I'm going to love it. I love getting mine every month. Alrighty, so let's get this open, shall we? All right, so the boxes pretty much all look the same. They've changed like just the size over the last year or so, but they're basically all the same. They all say scent with love. They are all very, very strong corrugated uh, cardboard here. Great for uh, reusing for maybe storing, putting other people's gifts in here or storing whatever you need. They all come with this little flyer every now and then. Maybe you don't get one. Maybe they've run out or forgot to put it in. Sometimes they have like a do-it-yourself fun project. Sometimes there's like a little list involved. But um, anyway, it says change things up. It's very colorful. Kind of looks like a patchwork quilt, doesn't it? It's very, very pretty, very colorful. The back might tell you an idea about what's in here. All right, so cool. We get the uh, spring summer catalog in here. It's going to tell you about sharing your unboxing. Oh, and I love it when we get these wax cups most of the time I get them every now and then I haven't got one but there's uh, usually sometimes you, you used to always get one which would be the uh, the pre-sniff for the uh, scent of the month next month and that's just really fun to smell it before anybody else does alrighty so oh okay I got I got it I think okay so they're calling this a fortune teller and do you remember well, some of you probably have no idea what I'm talking about. But back then, you know, we didn't have computers and handheld things like this. So we used to make these little paper things and you would fold it alternate ways and then you'd maybe put numbers or colors. So pick a color that was on the outside and then you'd say if it was green. So it'd be G-R-E-E-N. And then, okay, so now it's open up and then there'd be numbers in there and someone would pick a number. So maybe it was two, one, two, and then they'd pick a number again. And then all of a sudden when it was all done, you'd flip it open and there was like a cute little saying in there. That's what this is. Oh my God, this is going to be so much fun. So then there's all these sayings in here. So you're going to fold it basically on the lines. And it tells you all about how to do it. Oh my gosh, this was so much fun. We loved doing this. We could do this for hours. So, and, and we'd always make different ones. And yeah, it was funny. So yeah, this is going to be fun. Alrighty, so then get our little air pocket out of there. And that's what's in my whip box. Looks like, looks like some fun. Right, I'm going to open this first. Oh my gosh, this is Luna. 
Ah, uh, this is a sugar scrub. Luna was my absolute favorite scent. When I first started getting to Scentsy, when uh, our daughter Rena started selling it, Luna was my favorite scent. Oh my gosh, I, I loved coming home from the hospital every night and just, uh, it was just such a, a nice welcoming scent. So it's like the free, um, like fresh white floral. So it's like jasmine and sweet pea and some freesia and maybe some sandalwood, just very, very light, very romantic. Just, oh my gosh, I love Luna. So that's what this one is. And I got my first sugar scrub from them. Maybe it was like in one of the fall boxes and it was butter pecan and it really smelled nice. So once you open it, it's like, oh, it's kind of like liquid. But you know, you just put your finger in and stir it to get all that exfoliating sugar up here. And it's like uh, coconut oils and shea butter. And it's so, so moisturizing. So you just kind of take it out, rub it on. And then, yeah, you so take it off in the shower and oh my gosh your just skin just feels so hydrated and so moisturized afterwards and so fresh and so clean so it's going to have one of those little safety seals on it which is pretty good because otherwise i would be sitting here whoo i'd make a mess so you got this little safety seal right here but again just put your fingers in just kind of stir it around to get all that exfoliating sugar up and loose and mixed around so so good i am going to love this this is a great box already. So I think this has like a value of like $12. All righty. So next we have um, Scent Bar. So I think this, I think this is this month's, my earring got caught in my sweater. I think this is this month's bar. So it's red pear and pomegranate. And so all these bars have like eight little cubes, and then you're just going to separate them. So let me see what the other one is. I got another one too. So again, so I'm pretty sure this is this month, scent of the month. So these are normally $6. The scent of the month is like 10% off, so $5.40. Magnolia Lay. So I'm pretty sure this is one of the new spring summer fragrances. Or oh, Magnolia Linen. What was I thinking? Lace. It's a pretty, pretty color too. So again, um, you just have to kind of bend it and shape it for these to just to kind of separate those cubes. So you just kind of bend it like this. Just kind of bend it any which way you can. Let me see if I've got it perforated enough. Oh, I didn't smell that, that other one. Oh my gosh, this smells amazing. So this is like really really fresh clean fresh linen that's been dried outside in the summer sun just really fresh really clean and magnolias and honeysuckle i smell honeysuckle honeysuckles aren't that pretty to look at but oh my gosh they have such a gorgeous scent so again so that kind of like scored it like that so that all you have to do is go like this pop one out put it in your warmer and you are good to go reina Felicity, that's for you. Oh my gosh, that smells so pretty. Loving that. I just smell this one. Can't believe I didn't sniff it. So this is really sweet. You know, I can feel it here. Um, not peach. Red pear. Juicy, juicy pear. And of course, pomegranate. Well, it says red pear and pomegranate. Of course, that's what it is. But very, very sweet. You know what this reminds me of? And I know you're probably going to think, oh, she's thinking of alcohol again. No, this reminds me of Pampered Chef. Yeah. So, oh my gosh, we had the best Pampered Chef uh, consultant that we used to work with. Her name was Kim Barlow. And I used to work with her at Mini Systems all those maybe, what is it, 30, 30 years ago? Maybe over 30, 35 years ago. But she also did Pampered Chef. And uh, I remember one party that we she did for us, and it was like that, that the pizza stone, but it was the uh, thick one for doing like deep dish, deep dish pizzas. And um, so it was like with Pillsbury rolls. And then I think we rolled it with sugar and cinnamon maybe. And most people did apples, but she brought red pears. So we used that apple core to peel it and slice it up and then put that in there I don't remember, we might have even put butter in there or something, but oh my God, when that came out of the oven, it smelled delicious and tasted so good. This red pear, gonna remind me of Pampered Chef and Kim Barlow. Really, really good. 
All right, so next we've got a hand lotion. Oh yeah, and so that would be um, $5.40 and $6. And uh, watermelon tangerine, the hand lotions. Oh my gosh, I love the hand lotions. And I'm not sure if this is a new scent. I know I've never smelled it before. But the hand lotions are so moisturizing and they're like enriched with vitamins and they've got um, aloe and sunflower oil and they're really really good to have on your desk at work because you can just kind of take a break whenever you're feeling kind of dry and rub it on and you can get right back to typing because it doesn't leave a greasy residue it doesn't leave you sticky it's just really moisturizing and just feels so nice and the scents are so nice so i'm sure it's going to have one of those little uh, doohickeys on it all righty I need to smell this. Oh gosh, so let me put a little bit right here. So it's really a nice little moisturized. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. So it's uh, definitely tangerine and watermelon. Oh my gosh, I love rubbing this on. It just kind of, it soaks into your skin so fast and just leaves you feeling so moisturized. Makes your skin feel young. Oh my gosh, that feels good. Oh, it smells so nice tangerine and watermelon i think this is a nine dollar value all right and i got a couple of scent circles here and these scent circles i mean you can use them kind of like those um the dollar tree little pine trees or something and just kind of move that plastic up if you wanted to leave it in your car and just kind of so you don't get all that scent at once and just as it loose loses some of the fragrance, pull it up, or you can just take it out of the plastic bag right away. So you can use these in cars, even though they do have a car wax warmer. You can put it in like pantries, um, different shelves. You can put it in closets. Um, you can put it in like your children's locker locker bags. Or if you have, go to the gym and you have a locker there, you can put it in there, just kind of keep your things smelling fresh. I use mine in my towel warmer. So that um, my towel warmer, when you lift the lid up, it's got a, like a little thing in there. So I put these in there. So when I come home from work and with, well, when I take a shower, then of course my towels are in there. Otherwise my pajamas are in there. And they smell nice and fresh when I take them out. So I think these are both new fragrances, sand sweat. Alrighty. Alrighty. Yeah, I ripped the bag. Oh my gosh. I smell lemon, so I can kind of feel it back there. I don't know if it's supposed to be there, but I smell lemon. And kind of like, um, you know, if you're walking the beach, so you get a little bit of that fresh, salty air um, and lemon. And sometimes on the beach, um, you might find some wood. Don't don't burn that wood in, in a fire because, man, oh, man, it smells and it smokes for days. But but otherwise, if you were to cut a piece off and maybe make a little knickknack or something with that driftwood, that's what this smells like. So, ocean soaked wood, but not smoky, and lemon, and salty air. Vanilla wave. So, obviously, this one probably doesn't smell like vanilla. Eh, of course, I ripped it. Okay. So they say, I think if you put these like in a closet or a drawer, um, you should probably not take the plastic all the way up because I think there's probably some kind of oils in here. So that way it doesn't touch anything. But if you leave it open, that scent will still kind of come out. Oh my gosh, this is good. So it's vanilla, but not like, but not like just straight vanilla. It's like vanilla whipped cream because it's really sweet. A caramel, like a caramel latte without the coffee and then that fresh air again like you're at the beach having a vanilla caramel coffee it smells good you got whipped cream on it and you got the fresh air of the beach that's what this is like so nice Alrighty, and no samples but i should get the catalogs in here all right so and i think the uh scent circles are three dollars each okay so the new catalog and what i love about the catalog is when you go to the back the back of it if you just kind of wanted a quick overview, it's going to show you pretty much probably all the warmers that they have. The wall warmers, the uh, regular full-size warmers. It's got the diffusers probably up at top if I'm showing it right. And the diffusers are so pretty. The back is going to be some of the other items that they sell, like the uh, Scentsy Buddies for children, like the little stuffed animals. 
um, the buddy clips, some more items of different bases, the uh, cleaning supplies, just all really, really, so it gives you kind of a quick overview. Um, in it, it's going to, okay, so a page that shows you some of the puppy items. And that was kitchen items. Again, the uh, Scentsy Buddies. These are a few are just into just kind of like plain white warmers because you don't want it to really take away from your decorations in your home. And you just like kind of clean simple. They've got a bunch of white warmers right here. And some natural looking stone ones. And I have the one that looks at that plant right there. I've got that one with the uh, fake succulents in it. Just really, really nice. Um, let's see if I can find the page. It's got diffusers on it the diffusers are so so pretty and if you like to diffuse diffuse some oils just really really pretty so fun 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 stuff alrighty so we got the uh, catalog we got the sugar scrub we got two wax bars we got the hand lotion that I love and the uh, scent circles that I destroyed and a little fun thing so three dollars each nine six and five forty and twelve so probably right around thirty eight dollars right there so anyway not bad and yeah it's just a lot of fun to get some fresh ideas some new some new things to try, maybe some old favorites. It's just really fun, and I dropped my warmer. I wanted to show you my Valentine's warmer while I'm here, too, because I didn't get to show you yet. So, look at me. So this one, um, and I only got one. They did have a couple, but I just opted for one. And I got one of these little wall warmers. So this one, is, it's really, because you know Nancy likes her bling? So it's kind of like a pinky purple, and it's really heavy, heavy glitter. So it's perfect. Um, well, it's perfect for me. But if you had like a little girl that likes really dainty and feminine and girly things, this would look beautiful in her room for a little nightlight. And hold on to your eyes. Let's turn it on, see if we can get it to focus. Again, it's just really, really pretty. Just heavy, heavy glitter. Really, really pretty. And of course you would just put your wax cube right in there and the light in here just warms it up enough so it melts it it doesn't make it hot it's if, if your little one went and put her fingers in there and swirled around she's not going to burn herself it's just going to be warm it's going to be melted but she's not going to get burnt if um someone knocks it over and it goes on your floor uh, use a hair dryer and get it melted again and then just dab it up yeah so it's wicked easy uh puppies aren't going to knock it over it's food grade wax it's not going to hurt you it's just nice to keep it in there so it smells fresh and again it just kind of warms and then the fragrance just kind of permeates through your home it's so so pretty so but you might say well nancy that's fine and dandy if your wall socket goes like that but what happens if your socket goes like that right so it's got these this little thing right here that you're just going to push it in and turn it like that so if your wall sockets go like this you just turn it to go like that fits anywhere right and if uh, yeah my hair is always in my eye but if you didn't want to use it for a wall socket they also sell like little tabletop base bases so you can just kind of unscrew this and then put it on the table base and you've got fun to maybe sit on a night table or a small desk or something like that so they're just very versatile and like I said there is a style and a fragrance for everyone but anyway, I want to thank you all again for joining me. I always appreciate your stopping in and spending time with me. If you've got any questions, if I can't answer them, um, our daughter, Raina, she is the one that got me into this. She is my sensi guru. And yeah, so she, uh, yeah, she'll be happy to answer any questions that you have. Um, if you don't have a sensi consultant, I'll leave Raina's information um, below and she would be happy to help you out or get you some samples if you're interested in smelling something. And yeah, so I want... Thank you all again for joining me. I appreciate you so much. I hope you go out and have a fantastic day. We'll chat again soon, everybody. Bye-bye.